So I just saw the Joker movie today in Venice. It was the first projection of the day at eight o'clock and I'm going to make a review to you. So in this movie, it's based on the Joker being arrested and his life in prison. And then he is very depressed. He stays all along the, the movie depressed. He, he knew. He gets to know the Harley Quinn in the, in the prison where she was uh, interned by herself just to meet him and uh, they start uh, a romance and uh, before she um, leaves the prison she passes a night with him and then she, she starts to make visits to him and he was, he was waiting for his trial and then he uh, the trial starts. The trial is to to to, to see if uh, he will be convicted or not of guilty of the murders that he had committed in the first movie, and uh, it finishes this trial by he firing his lawyer and he taking the place as a joker in the trial and the, the place of the lawyer. So uh, the thing is, the, in the last day before he got sentenced by the popular jury, he says that he is not, not a joker, he is not a joker, and the, their fans got very um, uh, surprised by that and very sad and they leave the trial room and that's when uh, Harley Quinn also goes the, the movie is a musical uh, it's very different the, the, uh, it is very different from the, the first one and uh, because it's a mu musical and because uh, in this one uh, on the contrary of the, the first one Joker is only depressed. Joker that is at Arthur Miller is only depressed and he doesn't get um, better. As it happened in the first one, he was depressed and then when he got better, he transformed himself in the Joker. In this one, this thing doesn't happen. Uh, we have another characters uh, from, from the beginning that uh, they are the cops inside the prison. They are the lawyer, and they are uh, one of them is the um, the state lawyer that is fighting against the Joker. So uh, the movie has many musics, and they are uh, sing by Lady Gaga and also by Joaquin Phoenix. But um, uh, Lady Gaga sings, and they make a duo and Joaquin Phoenix can sing another kind of music but um, this uh, situation makes the, the narrative goes to a kind of illusion and also in the beginning of the movie it is presented to the spectators a uh, um, kind of uh, cartoon that where uh, Joker is the main character and he plays and everybody loves him and uh, uh, it, uh, he appears as the Joker one in the first movie and uh, he appears in that TV show and unlike the first one, this, he doesn't go have a TV show he has a TV show uh, that is uh, Joker and Harley Quinn but Harley Quinn comes in the first place uh, in the name and when he starts to think that um, she may be interested only in his fame and to have his place or got the attention of the public he um, takes a step out and then Harley King kills the Joker so the movie is uh, presented to the spectators as Joker being um, the dark personality of the main character Arthur Miller. And then 
at the end of the movie, after the final trial, that Joker is considered guilty, of course, uh, because he says that he is guilty and he doesn't hide this. Uh, Joker at the same time as a Joker, Arthur Miller at the same time that he is a Joker, he's, he uh, is killed in the prison and also Harley Quinn kills Joker. So uh, this makes the movie doesn't have a sequence. The movie won't have a sequence, we won't see Joker number three because he he's murdered in the end. It's not a move that is eye-catching, it's not a move that has appeal as the first one. It was very uh, surprising because uh, it seems that it doesn't work, it seems that something is going uh, wrong. It seems that uh, we don't understand what's going on uh, because uh, the, the main character is only depressed and the story is not focused only in him. It's uh, unfortunately this thing happens. So uh, this is like this. I, I have uh, many uh, suspicions that the public won't receive this move as the public has received the Joker number one because uh, it seems that Joker is not the main character in this he doesn't uh, change uh, the point situation of the uh, of the problem because they, they it doesn't seem to have a problem to be resolved by the Joker and uh, he doesn't change from the depression to to the main character that uh, his personality has, that is Joker. So the film is very, very boring at some moments, at many times it's very, very boring. And uh, to me, it seems that maybe Lady Gaga has um, something to do with it, not because of her, but because of the character uh, and because of the other characters that uh, had appeared uh, in the movie that, since from the beginning. So this is not fo focused only in Arthur Miller Joker and he doesn't um, uh, appear uh, as a transformation in Joker so it's boring disappointing and uh, not appealing uh, so it uh, was a kind of deception that's it